about six miles south of Copper Alpalus on Oberns Ferry Road. Uh, reason I'm choosing this clip is to showcase this really nice drive past Lake Tullock. I'm still up here on the ridge and you can see there's a lake out here behind all these residences. Uh, pretty tight turns here, 20 mile an hour. They've got a guardrail, etc. Passenger, you can look off to the right and see the lake. Sorry, I wanted to see the lake in the background. You've got this nice drive here. Pretty good downhill angle. Um, coming up on the other side, it's a little bit steep if you're towing a trailer or something. You can see how smooth that lake is out there. Immediately coming up on the right is uh, this Lake Tullock Resort. Every once in a while, you see a stage set up there. It looks like they do conferences and such. speed limit through here I believe is 30. Uh, I never see any law enforcement or CHP or anybody up here. But it is a nice drive. Beautiful scenery. There's a historical marker on the right. I believe it says O'Burns Ferry. I haven't checked that out but I'm kind of curious what O'Burns Ferry used to be. Doing about 30 miles an hour right here. A lot of cars parked on the side. Sometimes people like to go down and do their fishing thing or whatever. And they've got this really narrow bridge that crosses the north end of the lake. No big deal. I've you know encountered trucks here and big semis and whatnot. It's really not a big big deal. But you've got a real nice view of the lake. It's a little bit steep as you head up this hill. It's it's kind of a spirited little drive up here. Um, you can, if you want, you can get on it and you know heat up the tires a little bit. Of course, always maintaining the highest safety regard. Um, oncoming traffic usually is pretty well behaved. Uh, it's generally a nice little drive through here. I'll tell you what, it's it's a drag getting stuck behind a grocery truck or a semi coming up this when you're wanting to. Have a nice little spirited cruise. And this is a pretty good little hairpin here. Uh, if you plan your cards right, you can do it about 45, 50. I uh, wouldn't want to do it in the wet. And as you can see, the oncoming traffic pretty well behaved. They're usually on their side of the road. So I'd say it's generally just a really enjoyable little strip here. This is uh, just past Lake Tullock, heading towards Highway 108 on O'Burns Ferry Road. There's a couple passing lanes coming up here if you do get stuck behind some guy. You'll notice that the locals around here like to uh, think it's their entitlement to drive 35, 40 miles an hour on these roads when the rest of us are trying to get somewhere. So if you do this trip often, you can find the passing lanes. But if you're coming up here for a nice, enjoyable drive, you probably don't care. You just want to enjoy the nice terrain. Soon coming up here on the left is a... Uh, correctional facility. I'm going to go ahead and run the clip up until that point. There are deer. Uh, you can see the deer crossing sign coming up and that was my uh, memory. I, I have encountered two deer. I've probably made this trip about 50 times now. Um, so of course, you know, safety and motoring, you got to keep an eye out for, for deer. I'm kind of curious if those uh, deer whistles you can get for your cars actually uh, work. And here's a passing lane, usually very productive. I'm doing a speed check. It's not uncommon to see uh, CHP up here patrolling. Uh, and then coming up here on the left is, uh, I think it's called Sierra Conver Conservation Center. I don't know what they're trying to conserve. It's basically a big prison. Uh, and I'll end the clip here in just a moment. You can see the, the right, the left turn coming up. A little bit off cross traffic here so you need to keep your speed down in case some guys try and pull out after he gets off of work and there's the there's the prison right there. You can see the guard tower in the background and such so that's it.